What's going on guys? Guns are back again on another MLB The Show 19 Diamond Dynasty video. Today we're bringing back a series that we debuted in MLB The Show 16. Didn't touch on 17 but came back last year with it. This year we got a brand new one. We got the pack draft. Of course if you guys remember this, this is basically a brand new game mode that I made up myself back in MLB The Show 16. We did use DaddyLeagues.com which was basically like an online database for the show which had a pack simulator. However, I don't think they really do that anymore or at least they don't do a pack simulator anymore so last year we had to improvise a little bit meaning basically we had to delve into actual MLB the show packs which was completely not what I wanted to do with this series originally back then but you know I kind of had to do it last year um, and there's really no other better way to do it so looks like we're back with some MLB the show packs and basically the rules and stipulations are is usually we would do 25 packs this year it will be a little bit different because packs cost more and pack arts are better so i think we will be getting a better team basically you guys can see 20 packs i get to pick one card per pack 20 players and then our gold topper so that's 21 you're probably thinking but gomes where the hell do those other four players fit in i'm just gonna throw in random comments just because i don't feel like you know uh buying four more packs i just don't feel like it plus like i said pack outs are better so we're probably gonna get a better team it'll all even out so yeah once again going into our first pack um just like i said we can only pick one player per pack and uh we do get two silvers to start off and basically we're just going to make a team think of it kind of like a battle royale except um you know we're building our whole team and then we are going to jump into a ranked game so here we have two relievers we got peter strope and wade davis uh i'd go peter strope a silver reliever to start off this is you know pretty decent and we do get a gold card here actually jose leclerc we do get a silver as well ross stripling um once again this is pretty much a one game series that we're only using this team for um so i don't really care about starters let's go for the reliever on to the next one hopefully we can get something a little bit better hopefully position player thank you i've uh, got chris taylor i do believe he is a switch hitter um is there no way i can actually click on uh click on him um i guess not i i'm pretty sure he's a switch hitter though um but yeah i'm gonna go with chris taylor Ooh, another not so good pack right there oh god that actually is a very not so good pack um man i i i, I don't know i i really don't care see if we can turn it around okay we have another gold player i am gonna go through the animations this time hopefully it is a position player we've gotten a lot of relievers so far and what do you know it's brad hand a another reliever our bullpen is gonna be stacked so i think what i might do is just keep you know i have two gold relievers a couple silvers i think maybe i'll just pick common starters the rest of the way out um because uh i'm definitely not picking that you know common right fielder so once again going to the bullpen eight more to go hopefully we can get some decent position players we got francisco mejia uh he's a switch hitting catcher at this point good enough for me all bronzes danny santana um eric young jr uh tim lacastro give me uh give me eric young four more to go this team is actually really bad i'm not gonna lie we do get another goal player oh my god thank you thank you we have a goal position player starling Marte. i i don't have to explain it thank you mlb gods you're on the squad two more and then our guaranteed goal player i think we can get a diamond out of there hopefully we do um once again here there's like what the hell man that's pack and then of course we have our gold player topper i i need i need something out of here though i need at least a wow. oh my god we got a diamond we got a diamond though we we got a diamond man okay please please let that be good please let that be good i really need this 95 home runs it's a position player thank god um okay this is is this christian yelich this is christian yelich this is christian yelich man let's go let's go christian yelich yelly welcome to the squad baby go ahead just back flip on him one time let's go let's go man not only for the not only for this uh pack draft right here that is an amazing pull emote on him let's go need this to say we're going christian yelich
And then finally, our gold player top right here. Maybe can we get another diamond? Okay, we cannot. Uh, we get Angel Benatendi, so uh, we went on a really good hot streak at the end there, and we have an all gold and diamond outfield. I'm feeling a lot better about the squad. Well, um, yeah, I'm not gonna lie, this this team's pretty bad. This, this team's kind of cheeks, but I mean, we do have Yelich, uh, Benny Biceps, and Starling Marte, so that is definitely a saving grace offensively. And then, of course, we do have Brad Hand, Leclerc, and Pedro Strope. As you guys can see, um, the positions I didn't, you know, you know, get a pack for. I literally put the worst guy that I had there. So we have a 51 and a 49 starter, and then a 46, a 48, and a 47 overall reliever. Um, this is a 68 overall team. Um, our infield sucks. Our rotation is pretty bad. Um, our back end of the bullpen is complete garbage. But you know what? I think we can go on and get this win though. Still somehow. All right, this should definitely be interesting. I am actually, I think, about 487 ranked, so uh, 9 and 1. We are, you know, doing pretty good, so we'll probably match up against somebody with a pretty decent team. He literally has an all diamond squad. Uh, here we go. Here's the true test. Everyone says I only win because of my team. Let's see. Luckily, we did get Lance McCullers, our only silver in a rotation. He does have Ricky Henderson, so this is going to be an important first out that we need to get. See if we can try to jam him on this two-seam fastball right there. How the hell did he hit that? Like Alright, one, two, you know what to do. We're just gonna go with the knuckle curveball one time. Uh, easy ground ball to second base. Hopefully, we can make the play. Oh, that's a relief. Honestly, I was really debating, should I take this team into ranked seasons and just find somebody on my friends list to play? I decided ranked seasons, maybe this is a dumb idea because it could be an easy way to get an L, but you know what? I got faith, man. I really do. Here's the difficult part, though. Now we have to actually use this lineup. Thankfully, in the beginning, you know, we got uh, pretty much our only decent hitters. Once we get towards the back is when we're really going to struggle. At 1-1. 1-1 one, one Christian Yelich right there. That was kind of a fastball down the middle. I really wish I could have done more with that pitch, but we get a single. Oh my god. Maybe we're going to bring him around. I have no idea. Francisco Mejia had a pretty good Future Stars card last year. Maybe he can translate that. Or maybe he can pop up to the left fielder and waste Yelich's one time of getting on base. 3-1. This is kind of a tough pitch. We're going to throw a curveball. Uh, we actually do get it across, but that will be the first base hit for him so far this game. Altuve right there. One pitch, one out. Pretty easy work. I'll be honest with you. This challenge, I know, you know, my team, it is what it is. But if we could have at least gotten like an all gold squad, maybe this would be a lot easier. I'm right, going to start cargo out with a two seam fastball. Oh, thank you for swinging at that easy work. We get out of it. Oh, I'm I'm really scared. This is going to be a hell of a challenge. I really I, I don't know a part of me thinks we got this Part of me also thinks uh, it's only a matter of time until the floodgates open back to Ricky Henderson This is out we need to make sure to get because I cannot allow that 99 speed on base man I've been liking this two seamer inside we hang that a little bit uh, come on, Benny Biceps. Oh, no, I'm not going to try for a dive in. We play some dumbass defense. And I didn't want to get Ricky Anderson on base at all. Now he's on second. All right, one pitch change up. We do get Chipper out. That is going to get two, two outs on the board. This is a very important out right now. Let's see if we can throw him off the change up. Let's see if we can throw him off. He was ready for the change up. Oh, I told you, man. We could not let Ricky on base. He's going to strike first. Thankfully, his cap only has about 50 speed, so I shouldn't really have to worry about that. What? What are you swinging at, Altuve? That, that's another Altuve on top of you. It should be a nice ground ball. 78 speed. How oh, we do get him to bounce out of it. Clear the base pass. Right, Yelich has 85 power today versus righties. Uh, I'm going to try to power swing. Oh, that was a good curveball. I was not expecting him to throw that first pitch. What the hell am I doing? Oh, my God. One viable option at the plate, and I swing at that pitch. Try to blow me away. Try to blow me away, Christian Yelich. Oh, oh we hit that. It felt nice, but just hit him right where he was.
That's honestly so deflating of a feeling to get out with Christian Jelic because he's honestly our really one shot of scoring runs quickly. Back to goddamn Ricky Henderson. He's the reason why he scored that first run. And honestly, the way this game's going so far, it could be the one and only run of the ball game. Didn't work last time. What makes me think it will work this time? We do throw it to a Seabra. Come on, please make that play. Uh, why did I, why did I expect any differently? We got him at second base though. We got him in hot box. Oh no, don't you play that shit on me, man. Don't you play that smart stuff on me. I don't care if you got 99 speed, Ricky. Three outs. Go to count. Unfortunately, he does not have too much power. He does get a base hit or a second one of the ball game right there. Uh, a base runner though. We, we need it. We need it so bad. Out comes the mighty Taylor Ward once again. That's, that, let's see what he can do. Ground ball. And yeah, so much for that base hit, man. So much. Top of the sixth inning. I think this probably will be my last one with McCullers, especially if he keeps uh, giving up base hits like that. Actually, I think I'm going to call it right there. I am going to go with Brad Hand right here. He does have a pretty good amount of lefties in his lineup, um, so we should be pitching from the advantage quite a bit. Two seamer up and in. Not a chance he hits this. Not a chance. Woohoo! That was dirty. That was filthy. See if we can get a nice slider to make him bounce into one. Okay, we can hopefully get 160 speed. That has to be a good throw. Oh, come on. Let me replay that. Kind of feel like I should change pitchers, but I'm not going to. Um, if he swings like that with Altuve, then I, I should have no worries, right? Maybe I should. Maybe I should be worried. And oh my god, we were. Starling Marte really bobbles the ball right there. Oh my god. No. Oh. He, he's messing up. He doesn't know what to do. He's messing up. Throw the ball. Throw the ball. Oh my god. This game's rigged. <laughs> just cannot allow him to score anymore. And just as I say that, he he's going to score two more. It, it's a 4-0 ball game. This is honestly, like I said, the floodgates, they're open, man. Oh, they're open. Throw me a curveball. Colby Rasmus. Oh my god. Thank you, Shift. Thank you, Shift. We are going to get a double right there. Uh, it's even with 29 speed, we're going to get a double. Unfortunately, uh, I, I really don't know if we can bring him around. Fastball. Well, we could say we didn't get shut out. 68 overall team. We didn't get shut out. Yo, what if Yelich just uh, hit a two-run shot one time? You guys think of that? Oh my god, really? Oh, we were super late on that one. And he's going to make the catch. Oh my god. Well, luckily we did get two gold relievers. Uh, we got Leclerc. Oh my god, really? He could not have been earlier on that swing 99 speed. Benny's got an arm on him. Let's go, Benny Biceps. Ah. <laughs> Bro, I'm telling you, if, if I had a competent team, I win this game easy. I'm just saying, man. Give me my squad? Nothing. He get blank. Let's see if he wants to bite down low on that slider one more time. Like, hoo -hoo. Like, you can tell. If we're really swinging at that, man. I'm, something to think about. Something to think about. Honestly, I think the worst part about this team is the fact that I really don't have much power at all. Like, that's great. Mejia got a base hit. But now I don't really have any shot for a home run that can get me some quick runs. I basically have to piece together singles. All right, full count. Give me your worst. Give me your worst. Uh, that should get him over to third. Um, okay, if we we need to get this run, uh, it could be a two-run ball game. Taylor Ward, I, I literally just need you to hit the ball, but not be a pop-up and not be a ground ball to either of the corner infielders. That's all they need from you. And oh my god, that's that's not much better than a pop-up. I, I can't go. I, I can't justify going. I, I would have been out by a mile. Young Jr., it's a, it's a lefty at least, and uh, we're, we're really not going to score, huh? Runner on third, one out. Really not going to score. When I die, on my biggest regret list, it, it will be playing this game in ranked seasons. Absolutely. Should have stuck to the friends list and did a friendly. I wonder if Francisco Mejia is good at bunting. <laughs> oh no, he sucks. I wonder if Andrew Benatendi is good at bunting. Oh, not, not so much either. <laughs> Learn something new every day, huh? Well, that was an experience. All right, look. 
I, I know what the scoreboard might say. Uh, 4-1, we lost that game by three runs. But we had six hits. You know, for a while, it looked like we realistically had a shot. Uh, like I said, once again, if we would have got a little bit better on um, luck. And, you know, realistically, we actually did make considerable profit off that 30k. You know, just Christian the Elich alone doubled that. So that's good. You know, personally, I made stubs off that. So I'm happy. Uh, but at the same time, you know, my team, my team was buns. Like, you guys can't deny that. But at the same time, I also cannot deny... That, you know, I, I did not play good. I did not play to the best of my ability. And I allowed him to beat me. He did not win this game. Nor did I lose this game. I, I don't know what the hell I'm trying to say. All I'm trying to say is if you guys want to see another episode of the Pack Draft or anything about that, uh, make sure to leave a like down below on this video. And, uh, yeah. Hope you guys have a great rest of it. And there you guys, I'm out. Yeet.